Welcome back everybody, here we are, yet again, in our village, and I feel like we always somehow are coming in through this entrance, but that's alright. Uh, good to have you guys all back here, as per the usual. Today, we're going to be fighting the Wither, and doing a bunch of super different sort of things. I hope it's some stuff that, well, I know for a fact, there's uh, kind of like, you know, the little thing that we did in here last time with the villager? There's something that someone didn't know. Today's going to be one of those days, yet again. We're going to have something that you guys... Not a lot of you guys will know. A lot of you guys won't none. No, <laughs> and uh, trust me, we're gonna we're gonna get some cool stuff done today. That's not as effective as this, is it? I actually don't know which one's better. Okay, fair enough. Well, those guys are coming off because we got some big stuff happening. Another thing that I have to do is I'm getting some good stuff going on here with a whole bunch of potions. And in fact, I've just come from a, a very lucrative trip out to the jungle biome. In fact, I don't need that. I need that. That's right. That's kind of annoying. I've, <laughs> this is going to bug me for a long time now that these are facing different directions. It's kind of, there's, a, there's actually a, a few stairs that are, like staircases that I noticed which face different directions as well. Very, very odd. I think it's uh, these ones here. Like, uh, let me get these and get some of these. If I am correct, these, no, they do. Okay, never mind. There's something. I was messing around with them the other day and I noticed them in, in the creative menu, I'm pretty sure. That they are all, in fact, they might have been fixed in, in the most recent update. That could be it. I'll, I'll put it down on that, but that's alright. Uh, either way, today, let's let's set the picture. Zero deaths. We are on episode 17. We are 185 Minecraft days into this world. Zero deaths. And my name is Jancy, yet I am have not somehow done something stupid enough to have uh, landed up losing that that title so I'm kind of surprised I'm not gonna lie I I mean me being me I'm very very likely to just uh, forget and jump off a building thinking I've got elytra or something along those lines and, and yet I have not so I'm very proud and you guys should be too <laughs> the other thing is uh, our potions potions of healing we want to actually put on I'm pretty sure we actually want this, because we've been preparing for the wither, of course. So we need some very important potions. First potion will be a potion of healing, and I think that gives us, like, an extra strong one. Then we also need to go ahead and get ourselves a potion of... Well, you know what? We'll, I'll, I'll show you my potions once I'm done with them. That's alright. I want to show you something else that's been very cool, because between the last episode and now, as I say, I, I did some very lucrative uh, jungle... Exploring just because I need to get some <laughs> some cocoa beans and I also need to get some melon But I've gone ahead and added in a little bit more to this map so that we get a very good idea of where we're gonna be And what we what we've got so far so picture this this is uh, running south to north so north is this direction We are currently standing right over there pretty obvious right and around here We've got obviously our docks our little boat area uh, what we've been doing over here That still has to be fixed there, but think of this once this all comes around we can have this neat little circle With maybe a few more things coming around there. Oh, it's gonna it's gonna be awesome. Just uh, just wait for that I'll tell you now that's gonna be very very cool But last episode, I think I did mention it at least I thought it and it please tell me that oh, the Sun's going down uh, but at least I thought it was we we were going to be working in the jungle well not our jungle sorry our pirate area very very soon and that is all the way so we're going to go all the way around here we're going to chart a path around the edge over there to this area here which is where I plan on putting the pirate cove and in fact by the way uh, you'll find out today that this is very very relevant but if you've got some cool names for a cove or a, an area like that of course let me know because that can go down in there just like what we are doing today which is properly naming Spiritwood on a map and it's gonna be awesome and in fact this is this is the weird thing that I didn't think everyone might know maybe you guys know or maybe you don't uh, and also I just kind of did this now I've realized it's a bit silly of me to have done it that way because I can't use the can't use the the crafting bench as easy but that's all right we'll just do that we'll do that I will grab these out because it makes sense before I overcommit and then have to do these all at once so we'll put those in and one of those, perfect, we'll come back for that. So what I want to do here is I want to go ahead, make myself a banner, and this one's just gonna be a, we'll just go for a plain white banner, just to start. And what you can do on banners now, now I'm not too sure if all you guys know about this, but I'm pretty sure I'm about to show you guys something cool. We're gonna go and say spirit wood. And I think we should maybe, should we do that or should we go, I think, I think as one word like that, spirit wood. Okay, if you guys have got any objections, let me know. But I, I feel like 
come to think of it, every town or like place here in Australia, at least, that has got like a, a name like that surely has that. So what we want to do is we want to take this map over there. We, oh, yep, 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 that's good, never mind. We want to go to pretty much the town center, which is right around here. And we're just going to dig a hole down here because we can hide what I'm about to do, which is super cool. Uh, can I get rid of that? I kind of could, but probably not appropriate. Uh, if we go in here and we've got this spirit wood labeled thing and we go there. So that is our banner. And you can see nothing shows up here. But as soon as we right click on our banner like that, we've now got a little marker saying spirit wood, which I thought was one of the coolest little things I saw. In fact, I saw this a, f a few months ago. Um, or f weeks, no, it'll be months, yeah, it, f it feels like this just started just the other day, but it's, uh, it's actually been a while, 1.13, <laughs> it has, uh, but this is one of the new things we can do, and can I just place that over there, bam, look at that, so now, as we are looking at this map, I'm, I'm like, picture this, months down the track, when we are going great in this world, and by the way, we're gonna have world downloads, you guys will come to a map, you'll be like, well, by the way, the map's gonna be from, from this location. Well, I wonder where Spirit Wood is, and you look, 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 bam, there it is. You can find your way all the way here, it's got the little marker, and what we want to do today is I want to go and take a trip out here, so it's gonna be kind of starting, but we're gonna take a trip all the way around here, and we're gonna mark this as Pirate's Cove, or the Pirate Cove, which is just a temporary name for now, until we get a proper name for that. But I thought that was a very, very neat little thing. It would be actually really cool if I could have big writing for like the, the main island and then small writing for the smaller towns that'll be scattered around here. It'll be really neat, but uh, you know what? That's not that's not too important. What is very important for us to do right now is, is to get our stuff together. Uh, still not wearing any pants. Maybe I could put a little bit of an enchantment on that. 25 levels, <laughs> most likely gonna get my butt handed to me. Uh, yeah, you know what? I'll, I might just go and enchant that just so we got something better than nothing. I'll see if I can get some levels. If not, it's not a big deal. Uh, but that is what we are doing today, and hopefully it all goes well. And here is that moment of truth. Do I keep all my lives? Will I Will I make it out of here? Who knows? Well, uh... <laughs> oh man, Let, let's just quickly, let's just quickly uh, look at that. I don't think it actually says anywhere there, but here it is. By the way, if, if any of this does go bad, now oh, this is getting exciting, but if any of this does go bad, it, it's got the ability to go really bad because we are not very, very far away from the village. Uh, by the way, the potions, night vision, strength, regeneration, and both of those strengths and regenerations are on the, the good level ones. Uh, but this isn't very, very far away from the village. Uh, but the night vision is pretty important, as, as you guys guess. Oh, that's loud. Uh, yep. Yep. Yep, get away, and... Uh, you be, be helpful, please, Mr. Weather, and... Yeah. That was close. <laughs> it's kind of just holding back on me here a little bit. This is, uh, this is actually kind of weird, but you know what? I'm actually not too too scared of the wither, to be completely honest. I feel like I feel like this is going good. This is going real good. Really, really good. Okay. There we go. So, if for, for people who don't know this, now here, here's a how-to guide of how to not die with the wither. Because when I say this, of course, everything from here on could be completely ironic or be completely truthful. So, first step is <laughs> just chicken out every single time the wither shows its face. And every time you show your face, the wither's gonna, yeah, do that. <laughs> uh, it's kind of weird. I've never actually fought the wither from this kind of an angle before. And it, it should be getting pretty close now to halfway. And there we go. So what, what's this looking like? Let's check. Five seconds left, we'll just flip this out, go get our second regen, get our second strength. I think I might just keep my strength potion on. And the regen can maybe sit around in case we need it. I, I don't think we're gonna need it. It's, it's looking like we're actually going pretty good here. Uh, where is it? Ah, there. There. Yeah, I feel like now, this is not a good, a good thing, because if we can't hit the wither anymore, look at that, you see no no health going down? Uh, that means we're just gonna have to go for it. Let's just, let's just go for it. Alright, so strength all the way. Yeah, let's just, let's just do this. There we go. Okay, easy. Milk bucket, and we are good. Success! 
It's dark. I didn't think about another night vision potion. But there we go, we've got it. Okay, easy. That was actually surprisingly easy. I think we should have done double withers. I'm kidding, that would have been horrible. <laughs> uh, but there we go. Yeah. It turns out we keep our life for one more day. And uh, that was actually, honestly, I, I kind of did not feel I would do that well against it. And look at that. No pants. I didn't even end up doing that. Protection 3 and Protection 2. So we, that is that is by far the most undergeared I have ever gone into the wither, ever. And, uh, and I think that was actually very, very good. So now that we've got that done, that is fantastic. That is a huge, huge task to have finished. I also am not too sure if it's nighttime right now, so our village may very well be in a little bit of trouble. But speaking about the, the villagers, now there, there were many, many suggestions and I've seen these, okay, we're still good. I've seen these suggestions a lot and I just thought it would be good to maybe discuss what I'm talking about here. Well, discuss what I'm talking about. That, that's, uh, discuss what I'm thinking in, in terms of this. Oh, what, what a beautiful time to come down. The day's just finishing. Wonderful. <laughs> uh, all in a day's work, of course. So what, what people have suggested for the village is Jancy, why don't you put a fence around the village, or a, a, at least a wall around the village? I'll be completely honest with you, I could easily do that, and I have, of course, in, like, previous times when I've played around with villages and stuff like that. But to be completely fair, it's not a big thing for me to, to do that. I, I don't think it's worth destroying the look of the village just to keep the villages. Worst comes to worst, I can always just move some more villages in, and then good old Farmer Jancy over here is going to be having to feed him, and, and inevitably, it looks like Farmer Jancy is going to be the guy uh, to get this, uh, get these villages eaten again, because right now, there's no more Farmer, as we, as we know, we've lost the Farmer to a, a tragic incident. So, I think once we, once we start filling these guys up, they will sh well, they should, if, if I am correct, uh, they should, uh, with, the, with the amount of doors now, there's only two or maybe three of them in here, uh, start breeding. So, in fact, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to do this. Half a stack to you. Pick them up. Half a stack to you. Well, of my stack. And do your thing. Okay, maybe, maybe we need a third villager. There's, there's a very, very odd way of how villagers look for how they work. So we'll we'll deal with that a bit later. But either way, let's let's go get our Nether Star working. And this is very important for us. And this is actually the reason why I, I wanted to start this episode uh, and in the in the in the new area. But uh, we need this Nether Star because I want to do some very cool landscaping to this area as we get started. That feels good just to have a beacon. It does. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I want to do some really cool landscaping. And for that, we're going to need to get ourselves our beacon. Or at least just in general, a, uh, a, a low-level beacon. Enough to be able to do something with. So, this won't be quite a beacon. No, it should... Oh, uh, it should not be quite a beacon. We'll do this here. Get those. And I guess the gold... Over here, and I, d I don't want to get rid of my stacks, that's why I'm doing that, and I, I know we'll, we'll have some stacks left over. So, the gold over here, the, oh, that was almost perfect. <laughs> that was almost perfect. Uh, but there we go, that, that should be alright for us right now. The next thing is, I could also probably do some villager trading and get that, but that's, that's a solid base. Like, that's, that's two or three tiers. I think that's on the third level of, of beacon, so that's not too bad. Now, what I want to do, now that we got this done, is I've got some other things that we need to get done today. And here we are, coming into the Pirate's Cove. It's going to be a, a very, very big area. And I'm kind of a little bit uh, a little bit concerned with how big I've got this area, so we might, might do a few changes to it. But this is what it's looking at right now. Okay, so we've got this area here, which is going to be awesome to be terraformed. Imagine this, just with all these trees coming off, and just, you guys name it, we, we, we'll have it in here. This area around here, and by the way, I've got a map on me, so we can... Look at it, like that. So we're looking, we're looking south right now. So we're looking down onto it. So we've got all this area here, which we can go out that way. We'll have some docks coming out here. I'm kind of picturing in my head, at least, that this is going to be an area where we, where the pirates have taken over. I, I think something along those lines, but th there's so many ideas, so, so many ideas. In fact, last episode, uh, I, I saw some cool ideas about it, just in terms of the, uh, in terms of the way we're going to be doing it. By the way, I'm just going to do this. There. And then we are going to go and do this. There. 
Perfect. Uh, just in terms of the ideas of it, and I, I think I'm gonna have to go watch Pirates of the Caribbean again. I feel like that's something that that has to be done, just because it's a, it's such a it's the pirate movie. You know what I mean? Uh, that and uh, and I think another one which could be kind of cool. And believe it or not, I, I feel like I don't don't think I'm gonna watch it again. But I feel like it'll be cool just to to maybe see if I can get some cool uh, looks. Is is Peter Pan? I feel like that could be that could be a good one. But uh, I'll, I'll have to see with that. So that that's something. And then the other thing, here's something I before I forget, we'll, we'll we can even come back to that. But before I forget, we had sixty thousand subscribers on YouTube like yesterday or the day before. I think it was yesterday when this video comes out, which is absolutely nuts. And uh, that is crazy. And, and I don't really look like at the numbers and like they are cool, but you do, you know you don't really focus on the numbers. You just have fun doing what you do. And and sixty thousand, regardless of that. 60,000 is a lot of people to uh, click subscribe and uh, and watch watch videos and stuff like that So thank you so so much guys. That is that is really really awesome And of course here's, here's to many many more that is that is that is the way it's gonna be There's gonna be so so many uh, more videos still to come and all that sort of stuff It's uh, it's really really awesome just to see after 60,000 people how much uh, how much of a cool positive Bunch of people we've had we've got here, which is it's just it's just cool. I don't know what to say besides it's it's awesome Okay, uh, but what else is awesome and what hopefully will be awesome is getting a tree done Which will somewhat represent this area just very very minimally. I don't want it to be too crazy. Oh Okay, here we go. You know, what? we thought the wither was gonna be what's gonna kill me. This is what's gonna kill me if I miss this Oh, <laughs> oh. I'm actually gonna start just being a little bit sillier with this see see how far I can take it without actually uh, Without actually losing my life. I, I feel like there was a there's a movie I'm trying to think of now where where in the movie the whole movie goes by and And you're just gonna be like here it are oh, I think it's hot tub time machine That's it where the whole movie you're like this is where the guy's gonna lose his arm the guy's gonna lose his arm doesn't lose his arm and uh well, I mean, have yeah, given given away part of it, but <laughs> but yeah, that that's what it's like. That's what it's gonna be like. You're gonna be like, Jancy's done it now. This is it. There's no way he's getting out of this. And then somehow, uh, that that's what it's it's been so far <laughs> for me at least. So let's let's go up here. Let's just check, make sure this is at least. I, I shouldn't have left my boat out there, uh, but let's just go and double check that this is becoming a cool looking little tropical tree. Yeah, simple. It's, it's got like that shape. You see, I don't want to do, this is what I see very often is people go outward. I'm trying to go for this real like hanging kind of vibe. I don't know why. I just, I just think it'll be real cool. And I've actually got a, a very cool tree that I, I was playing around with in creative the other day uh, to show you guys. So when we get to that, oh man, it's going to be good. This one's just temporary. This, this tree is actually, this is more of like a, a, a placeholder, more of a, like signifying what we are doing uh, less than what it is, if that makes sense. So so fear not, this is not what the tree will be looking like. In fact, can I place a thing like that? I can. And that one just grew, thank you very much. So I guess I'm just gonna have to do it over here like these. And then what we'll do is we'll, we'll go out here and we'll, we'll do this. So this is gonna be like, um, a, a, like the hanging, this, this, uh, this actually comes from an idea from palm trees that I've seen where they do hang like this. But, uh, I, I think I think the important thing is just to, to maybe go a little bit different with them and, and do stuff like this where they hang over Where they maybe have a, a slightly different shape even if they don't necessarily Exist in the real world sometimes sometimes it's just good to to have an odd shape in these things So there we go. Let's just do a bit like that and a bit like this and I guess actually As much as I was messing around with that one little piece there It's not gonna be too useful to me. So we'll get out here and go down here, and I think that will be a very good tree. So, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Let me down, please. And also another thing. Here's here's one more thing. There's there's so many things. I I see all these comments, and I forget what I was gonna tell you guys. But another one which people have been commenting for a few episodes now is about my silk touch pickaxe. And yes, I'm well aware I can fix it. But the the reason I don't is I use these pickaxes here. So when I get level thirty. I go ahead and enchant that, and if I get a very good enchantment, I, I use it till it's almost done, and then I'll go and step back, and I'll, I'll create another one. And, and what that means is that means I've got a library of different enchanted pickaxes to choose from, and I can make a, uh, a selection as to which ones I want to keep, and, and all that sort of stuff. So I could just keep using the Silk Touch one till the very end, I get it, but 
I, I'll, I'll just use it in, until I eventually feel like fixing it. It's not, it's not really something that's of, of great importance to me just at the moment. But if it, if push comes to shove, I'll fix it in a, an anvil. Yeah, that is, that is a very cool looking little tree. You see, it's slightly different to your average one, but uh, I think it looks really cool. And as I say, I've got a very, very, very neat way of doing these palm trees, which I think, you know what? will probably come next episode or the episode after it. But I think for today's episode, uh, despite the fact that we defeated a wither, we did not at least die to the wither, which is fantastic. And I did, yeah, I did click that, perfect. Uh, so I think we've had a very, very successful day, guys. I'm gonna fix the back of this tree, but for now, that is us for today. So thank you very much for joining me, guys, and I'll see you very soon.